Good evening, 47. The target is Jimmy Chen, a cynical tabloid journalist who will literally kill for a good story. A failed actor who became an internet sensation, the target has made a name for himself in online journalism by creating fake stories and sensational headlines. When taking on a pharmaceutical conglomerate, Chen obtained evidence that the company was withholding damaging data on an antidepressant. Instead of going public, Chen sat on the material for a year until a sudden wave of suicides gave him the sales hook he needed. Our client's sister jumped in front of a train and they hold Chen accountable. We have intercepted information suggesting Jimmy Chen is currently researching a secret society for a US tabloid magazine. Good luck, 47. Welcome to the Isle of Scale, 47. The target has been spotted near the Keep Gallery, dressed as a waiter. Look for anyone who's acting out of character, and remember to collect Chen's voice recorder. Alright, here we go. So, this is the first elusive target I've played since they first started doing them. Uh, I was worried I was a little rusty. I haven't... I've just been playing the uh, Sniper Assassin maps, and I was uploading them. So, I was... Uh, Worried I'd be here for like an hour trying to figure it out, but they made this one pretty easy. I got it on my first try. I don't know, maybe they were trying to make sure it ended on a good note that people were successful and they weren't all pissed off at the end. Um, but right now, uh, if you listen to the Diane, you pretty much know the elusive target, the stowaway, is going to be in the gallery room. So right now, I'm just going to grab a guard disguise, and this guy's out here by himself he's an easy target and then you can just drag him into the grass and then I'm gonna make my way to the gallery um, and then I beat this on my first try so that I was like ah, I still feel like playing so I actually downloaded that that ten dollar patient zero mission for uh, that was came with the uh, legacy package or whatever uh, I mean it wasn't it even wasn't what I thought it was I thought it was like its own standalone mission and its own level and location but what they did was they broke it up into four different boards that are just um, old levels from Hitman 1, like Bangkok, Sapienza. And then they give you new targets for that. So it was kind of a disappointment. I'm hugging this wall because there's a camera on the other side. Just be careful there. So I did the first one. I'll upload them all later. Um, I'll upload all the uh, suit only Silent Assassins. And it was pretty cool. It was like interesting. It was like a doomsday cult. You had to kill two targets, but we'll see if it was worth ten dollars. I was just looking for something to do. All right, so right now I'm in the gallery. I'm just looking for the guy. I'm not sure. I know he's in here. I'm just not sure where. They said he's a, dressed as a waiter. So that looks like the guy, but I'm not sure. This lady's being a bitch. And there's another waiter. And then I seen that. I don't remember that from the main game. I don't recall that having a waiter spilled something there, but it's been a while. So he's leaving. So I look over here and then I see that suspicious behavior. Get him. If the location is not favorable, yourself. find a way to make the target move to another location. Oh, no need to freak out about a quick snap. I mean these pics are, are like for my personal files. Let's just forget about the whole thing, okay? Phew. I think I might take a small breather. You know, I've been standing up all day. Yeah, you, you know, you, you gotta look after your feet in this business. When you're a waiter, I mean. <laughs> yeah, nothing mysterious about that. Target is on the move. Follow him, 47. All right, so you should approach him. I should give you the option to talk to him. And then he's going to walk off real fast. I wasn't sure what was going to happen, so I just followed him. He goes up to a bathroom. Um, and I just went in and broke his neck. And make sure you grab the uh, dictaphone before you leave. Um, just be careful. If you get too close, it seems like it 
he'll stop and stare at you and then just just back off and keep your distance and wait for him to keep walking uh, I brought the lockpick I always bring the lockpick and the room you kill him in there's a room attached to it where that you could open with the lockpick I just dragged him in there and to hide his body better and I tried to throw him off the side of the castle wall but the walls were just too high when it let me uh, drag him off and throw him so I left this body in there shut the door see like sees kind of sees me here so I just back off and and remember you can't save but if you mess up you could always restart but if you start doing the objectives kill him or retrieve the dictaphone um, then you can't restart either so you always want to make sure that you got every that you're in the clear before you start killing people or completing objectives so I I just grabbed him and killed him here I wasn't really sure what was gonna happen but I wasn't too worried so right now I'm just looking around because I want to see if there's somewhere to hide his body in here I just forgot this area so I was hoping I could throw him off the side here but it just wouldn't let me so I just drag him in there leave his body grab the dictaphone and I just went out the way I came because I wasn't I couldn't remember the exits too well so I just like I'm just gonna go out the way I came so I because I know you know how to get there just gotta be careful when you're in the guard outfit some of the other guards can see through your disguise so if, if you have to run past them well, all I did was I just threw a quarter to distract them so if you're doing it this way just make sure you have something to throw that's pretty much it I was surprised how easy it was but like I said I think they just made it easy because they wanted to end it on a good note they don't want a bunch of bunch of pissed bunch of uh, you know pissed off gamers yelling at them at the end of the season but I'm gonna leave this up and then I'm going to uh, start uploading the patient zero stuff about <laughs> six seven months later <laughs> than when it came out oh well alright thanks for watching if you got any comments let me know in the comments section obviously I'll see you guys later bye
I knew our nameless friend would come through. 